HCF and LCM of numbers. The greatest whole number, which is a common factor of two or more whole numbers, is known as the highest common factor or HCF of the whole numbers. We can take the numbers 15 and 18. The factors of 15 are 1, 3, 5 and 15. The factors of 18 are 1, 2, 3, 6, 9 and 18. Clearly, 1 and 3 are the common factors of 15 and 18. Therefore, the highest common factor of 15 and 18 is 3. The smallest number which is a common multiple of two numbers is called the lowest common multiple, LCM of the numbers. Let us compare the multiples of 15 and 18. The multiples of 15 are 15, 30, 45, 60, 75, 90 and so on. The multiples of 18 are 18, 36, 54, 72, 90 and so on. We see that 90 is the lowest multiple that is common for both 15 and 18. Therefore, the lowest common multiple of 15 and 18 is 90. Finding HCF and LCM of the numbers Let us find the HCF and LCM of 168 and 180. First, we write the prime factorization of both the numbers. 168 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 7. 180 is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 into 5. HCF is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 equal to 12. We can say HCF is the product of all the common prime factors. LCM is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 2 into 3 into 5 into 7 equal to 2520. We can say that LCM is the product of all the common prime factors and the remaining factors appearing in both. Let us now verify the relation between the HCF and LCM of these numbers. HCF into LCM is equal to 12 into 2520 equal to 30,240 Multiplying 168 by 180 also gives 30,240 Therefore, we can say that the product of the HCF and LCM of two numbers is equal to the product of the numbers. Line Segment Look at the edges of the objects present in this room. The edges of the doors, windows, tables and books kept on the table are fixed lines from one point to another. They are called line segments. A line segment is a part of a line having a definite length. 
it has two end points line segment ab symbolically is written as shown here take a point a from this point draw a line of 6 cm to another point b this ab is a line segment plane tina is looking at the mirror on the cupboard top she observe that it is a flat surface the walls and floor of the room are also flat surfaces all such flat surfaces are parts of planes a plane is a flat surface which extends endlessly in all the directions we represent a plane in the form of different two dimensional surfaces like a rectangle a parallelogram or a triangle see this parallelogram a b c d it is a plane intersecting and parallel lines what is a cross it is simply a pair of lines that cut or bisect each other at a certain point in the shown pair of lines ad and bc intersect each other at the point o these lines are called intersecting lines now let us consider a different pair of lines here lines ab and cd do not cut or meet each other at any point and move on endlessly such a pair of lines is known as a pair of parallel lines such lines always keep a fixed distance from each other polygon consider a few objects a guide a notebook and a pizza slice these objects are closed curves of figures made up of only line segments a polygon is a closed shape formed with the segments we will take some pencils and arrange them in different orders to make different polygons shapes with curves like a circle are known as curvilinear figures observe the following curvilinear figures sides vertices and diagonals of a polygon look at this shape pqrst it is made up of five line segments which are called the sides of the polygon line segments pq qr rs st and tp are the sides of the polygon pqrst pq and qr qr and rs rs and st st and tp are the sides that are next to each other and are called the pair of adjacent sides the point where two adjacent sides of a polygon meet is called the vertex of the polygon here p q r s and t are the vertices of the polygon p q r s t the line segment that joins any two alternate or non adjacent vertices of a polygon is known as the diagonal of the polygon ps sq pr tr and tq are the diagonals of pqrst this table shows the names of polygons according to the number of sides each polygon has polygon number of sides number of vertices number of diagonals triangle 3 3 0 
quadrilateral 4 4 2 pentagon 5 5 5 hexagon 6 6 9 heptagon or septagon 7 7 14 octagon 8 8 20 nonagon 9 9 27 decagon 10 10 35